Okay guys, so I thought I'd make a quick little tutorial on how to clear your 5M cache. If you are encountering, encountering issues on any server, whether it be LCRP, uh, or, well, any 5M server that you play on, if you encounter any issues, you should always try to reset your cache first. So, what you need to do is with your 5M application shortcut on your desktop, or if you don't have one, if you hit your Windows button and type 5M, it should appear. What you want to do, right click it, open file location, and it will open a folder that looks like this. And inside this folder, you will have probably four, maybe five files. C click on 5M application data. If it takes you to another shortcut or another little photo of this, right click it, open file location, until you get to a screen that looks like this. Go into 5M application data, go into data, and then you should have these five files here. Now what you want to do is you want to press your left control button on your keyboard, select cache, game storage, server cache, and server cache crib, or server cache private. Right click on them, let go of control and right click on them, and select delete. And when you relaunch 5M, it will download all the data. And when you reconnect to the server, it will re-download all the data again. And it should have no issues at all. Um, if the issues still encounter, then I would suggest maybe if it's that bad or if it's um, an issue that prevents you from playing uh, how you prefer or how you want to, then I would re really suggest reinstalling 5M. Uh, or making sure that it's not an issue with the server. Um, always, always ask the moderators, uh, the admins, or even the developers about the issue first before you go ahead and delete your 5M. Um, because don't forget, when you delete your 5M, if you do not have your graphics packs or shaders packs backed up, then you'll need to re download them and reinstall them as well. So please always make sure with the server community for that 5M server that it's an issue with your side or the server side um, before you do anything. But clearing cache is easy like I've just explained and it should always be the first step you take. So thank you very much guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Peace out.